pretenders back on the chain gang. The intro is playing partial chord shapes against an open D and E string. So the first one is a partial D, and that's open, seven, seven, open. And that's coming from that D shape. It drops down to a partial A, which is open, six, five, open, which is coming from that A. And then it drops down to a G. You're going to really play in the, the top five strings, so it's more of a G with a B in the bass. So that would give you... The chord sequence for the um, intro under the lead line and for the verse is a D sus2, so that's open four, second, third, open, down to an A sus4, which is open, two, two, three, open, down to an E minus seven, which is open, two, two, open, three, open. So across those chords, that um, third fret on the second string is always ringing out. And that would then be For the second um, time on the E minor 7, you can actually move across and using your second finger, you go on the second fret of the first string and your little finger, the third fret of the first string, and that would give you so that you can follow the riff from the song. So once through, If you can't quite manage that bit, just stick on the E minor 7. So under the intro lead line, you play that twice. And then for the verse, both verse 1 and verse 2, you play it four times. So coming out of the intro and just playing it twice. The first chorus is E minor to A three times. But the second time through, you can for the E minor play So you play in the E minor and then on the first um, string you're going from the 3 to the 2 to open. And on the A you're going from the A sus4 down to the A to open, so that's the A sus2 and then back to the A. So. So that would give you So coming out of the verse and into the chorus and going through the chorus and 
back into the next verse. The next verse is the same as the first verse. The next chorus only differs because instead of going three times through the E minor to A, you're going to be playing it four times. So... So you're playing the little riffy part twice this time. Coming out of that, it's the lead repeated and the chords under it are three times through the verse chord sequence. So just... And then you finish that with four down strokes on the D. The song now transitions and you're playing from a D minor to an A. So that would be... times, then twice with the riff, which would be So on the D minor you're lifting your first finger up and putting it down again, so So just exaggerating the lift And on the A, you're putting the first finger down on that first fret of the first string. So again, exaggerating it. So playing through that twice. While you're getting the structure of the song, you can just play the A to D minor straight as well. Then you play the D minor back through A four more times, either with the riff or without. And then you hold on the A. And then you get the trickier part of the song, which is a key change, upper tone. Ways I've seen people play it, some people have just completely ignored the fact that there's a key change and they play through the first verse and chorus structure just using the same chords as the first time. I've seen people playing it from E to B to A back to B for the verse and then just E to B for the chorus, but the way I think it's played is E to B and I'm naturally just muting out the first string when I'm playing a B that way. I'm playing the middle four strings back to an A Again, my first finger is muting out that top string. And then a riff from the barred top four strings to the fourth to the fifth on the first string. So playing through that, hopefully not making a complete mess of it. So that's four times, and then for the chorus, it's 
F sharp minor to B. So playing through that the way I think it's played. And then you play out on an E to a B. That plays out into the fade. And you can either play the E and the B here, or you can play the E and then go up and play the B higher up with the top two strings ringing open, which would give you more of a... If you wanted to play it more simply though, you can either ignore the fact that there's a key change or I'll play it through the way I have seen some people do it, which is just the E, B, A, B, which would give you... Anyway, good luck with this one. Hope it made sense.